The title of this video is How One Person Can Move a Huge Awkward Couch with a Hand Truck Dolly. But I do realize this is going to be boring for most of you, so I have included a message from Mr. Rivalwick. Yes, Mr. Rivalwick sends a letter to the world in one moment. Let's hear the sound effects first. Well, you might have found that funny, but hey, most of the time you need two people to move a couch. And if you put the dolly in the front, it doesn't work right. So anyhow, it is what it is. So here we are. Without further ado, I give you Mr. Rivalwick's message or letter to the world. In the years following the endless war, America floundered. Its people obese with a sense of entitlement, Netflix, and fast food. They lay in fear, inaction, in ruins. The weak fell to viruses and superbacteria. The strong felt paralyzed with corporate media fear mongering 24-7. Much like the years following WW2, Europe was in a daze back then, and America took the center stage away from their European peers. Only this time, it is the Asians, Chinese, who won because they did not invest, again, they did not invest their money in a hopelessly futile war as America and her allies did. China is front and center on the world stage, singing her victorious opera. You have been weighed and found wanting. Cambio de la guardia, changing of the guard. So in other words, there's a new sheriff in town. And if there's still anyone out there with their head in the sand and has any doubts at all about what is going on, I have a message for you. Omicron. <laughs> no, that is not a 1980s Japanese TV robot. No. Omicron. We made up that name for anyone not paying attention. Is an anagram. Moronic. You get it? Good. <laughs>